Do I trust the police? I think it depends on the situation and where I am and where I am and who it is. Um, from everything that has been communicated through, especially through um, law enforcement and even the judicial system, um, I have come to believe that my life, and especially the lives of my sons, are less valuable um, to America. And so things that have less value and significance and importance, we tend um, to treat that way. So, you know, it's always the, the fear of, okay, where is this person, this police officer on this particular day in this place? You know, who is he and what does he feel? And um, I was talking to someone recently who was saying that her brother-in-law was a police officer and that he, his greatest and first primary identification, um, according to him, in his words, was with blue, not with any other color. Um, and almost to the point in the language that was used to where it's robotic. Well, this is what this is what we do. This is these are the things. This is how things are handled. This is what we're allowed to do in this situation. Um, but I think the what we do varies based on who is standing on the other end of the gun. And so, because I feel that. Um, it has been declared in many ways that we are less important, less significant, um, less needed, and less valuable. I have less trust for, for the officers. Um, still, if there's a crime committed, who else am I going to call? But it is a great possibility that, depending on who's making the call, the victim can be harmed in this situation. I have a young man that lives down the street from me in Atlanta, and he shared with me once that there were some, some people that came to his house to fight with him. And they were trying to get in his house, trying to start a fight, He's an African-American um, young man. He's tall, um, not tiny, but not huge. He called the police. His mother called the police. The police came. They ended up having him out on his lawn, face down in handcuffs. He was calling because someone was coming trying to attack him at his house. And he ended up on the lawn in handcuffs. It makes it difficult to fully trust that I'm safe with law enforcement, law enforcement in America. 